All right, today we're gonna make a recipe that scares me because it is the only one that's gotten me death threats. <laughs> um, it's a Portuguese sandwich called uh, Francisinha, and last time I made it, uh, Portuguese people were very angry at me. So we're gonna see if I can uh, satisfy them or make them even more angry today. Let's do it. All right, so first, got a piece of sirloin steak here. pepper on it, and I'll do the other side as well. First, we're gonna start with the sauce for the sandwich. I'm gonna put in maybe like half this can. Let's put some salt in here. Now, we're gonna season it. This is like one of the main things with Francisina. Every bar has their own like secret uh, sauce ingredients. You know, everyone does it differently. So we're just gonna wing it. And let's do, uh, let's do some curry powder. Feeling a little turmeric. Make it, the color a little bit brighter. White pepper, all right. Great. Let's add some bay leaf. Mainly because like I never get to use it in other stuff. So I need to turn on this one now. I'm going to prep the other meats we have here. We have some prosciutto. I think that's a pretty standard thing to put on it, either the prosciutto or ham. And then we have actually what you do need, uh, which is linguica. It's a like smoked uh, Portuguese sausage. This looks like to fit on our sandwich, we probably want to half it and then go down the middle as well. I'm gonna add some beer to the tomato sauce. See if I get the sausage at the same time. I think we need some more salt. I want like two big pieces of bread in like the center of it. Uh, is it done? Yeah, there we go, it's good to hear. Uh, real quick while I'm doing this. Let's see if I can toast this at the same time too. Yeah. Oh baby, here we go. Let's see, we can got our finished steak here. We've got our linguica sausage. Maybe I can only fit three. This is prosciutto. You thought I forgot the cheese? As far as the cheese, I'm not sure what is most commonly used in Portugal. I'm just gonna go with cheddar, because I like cheddar. And then normally you put a fried egg on top, but uh, my cameraman is uh, egg intolerant.
Es geht.